For fears of a repeat of a capital insurrection, there are security concerns rising right now ahead of a rally uh, by people who support those arrested, some convicted already, in the January 6th attack on the Capitol. Capitol Hill security concerns are growing again ahead of a right-wing rally planned for next month. The event is a show of support for jailed insurrectionists charged in the January 6th riot. CNN's Melanie Zanona, Zanona has more. Well, the Capitol is always a target, but there are heightened security concerns right now among both lawmakers and law enforcement officials ahead of two key dates next month. One is a rally planned for the campus grounds being organized by a former Trump campaign staffer in support of the jailed January 6 rioters, and the other is the 20th anniversary of the 9-11 terrorist attacks. Now, security preparations are underway for that September 18th rally. There are serious talks of reinstalling that temporary fencing around the Capitol. The MPD is going to be fully activated that week, and the Capitol Police received a memo warning that this group tends to attract far-right extremists, so there could be unrest and violence. Now, the same memo also said that similar past events haven't turned violent, and so far only 300 people have told the event organizer that they plan to attend, not to mention it's taking place on a Saturday during recess, so far fewer people will be around that day. Still, these fresh fears come as Capitol Hill is still reeling from January 6, as well as a recent bomb scare that had the community on edge, even though it ended without incident. Uh, just take a listen to what this Congresswoman Madeline Dean told me in an interview this week. She said, quote, you don't get an insurrection on January 6 and all threats of violence go away. In fact, the fear is that future planning will produce other violent acts. I'm most concerned for my staff, and I also worry for the Capitol Police. They are strained, they have been heroic, and they saved all of our lives at great peril to themselves. So while no one wants to be overly alarmist here, everyone is on edge and preparing for every single possible scenario because nobody wants a repeat of January 6. Melanie Zanona, CNN, Capitol Hill. Thank you so much.